from Drinkbox Studios. Well, I don't have to say it. <laughs> So, welcome to the next installment of Metroidvania Marathon. One. Are you home, one? One. Wake up, one. Because these Metroidvanias, uh, lots of them are based on real world cultures, like. Bloodstain was based off Victorian England. Etora was Mesoamerica. Now we got one based on Mexico. Lovely. Well, this seems to be the map. Not bad. Like, just the way this dude moves so far. You're finally awake. Noon is upon us. The sun. The sun's at its zenith. No time to sleep the day away. The Dia de los Muertos festival is nigh. Oh, wow! Uh, a story based in Mexico. That's about Dia de los Muertos. How cliche. He's looking at Coco and the Book of Life. Take some time to compose yourself. I can use your strong arms at the church once you brush your teeth. Well, I want to go this way first. Pesos! Uh, my first guess here is Ground Pound. Pueblucho. Hey, Juan! Oh, the luchadores are practicing for the upcoming Dia de los Muertos tournament! I can't let you pass! Well, screw you. One, I have a fiesta soon. I don't want to be short on tequila. Oh, sorry, Ron. I'd love to invite you, but it's Vigidoras only. Well, looking at the promos for this game, I can tell what we're going to become. Sandy is quiet in the house these days. I just can't bring myself to get rid of her favorite toy, though. So I keep it in the cellar under the stairs. Whose favorite toy? Your daughter's? I want that toy, that looks cool. I need the... No, I can just jump over here, right? Okay, don't need the double jump yet. Hola, Juan! You remember my son, the Lichadora? He caught three bandits trying to steal holy water from Frey Ay Ay Ay. <laughs> There's really a place named that. <laughs> It's true, I was a real uh, mamacita in the old days. You better believe it. Hola Juan, thanks for coming to help. I'm trying to clear out some space in here. We're expecting people to come from all over for the festival. Even El Presidente's daughter has returned from La Universidad de Santa Lucita. Enough gossip, because he busts up those empty wine barrels over in the corner. Yep, I already know how to do that. What strength? I knew you had it in you. <laughs> yeah, and that just magically makes the debris go away. And the Residente's daughter always said she saw your potential as well. Such a nice girl, and I'm so glad that El Ambassador's son is out of the picture. Him and El Cabinet Minister's wife. What a scandal. Alright, it sounds like it's gonna be a plot point. Uh, Ablando del Rey de Roma! Look who appears! Hello, Frey. I... Juan! Frey asked me to stop by today. I didn't expect you to be here. Juan, you look so... Remember when we were kids? We used to get into so much trouble together. Well, that feels like so long ago now. You've really... grown up. 
I am just going to point out that, like, whenever I view these Mexican cartoons, like, the main character almost always has one of the most common Mexican names. Like, Coco had Miguel, Miguel Rivera. El Tigre has many Rivera, so Rivera's one. Miguel is also one, because Maya and Miguel from that cartoon. Um, Juan is also a common Spanish name, so here we are. Anyway, Freddy, I found those channels you were asking about. I'll bring them over later. I remember that brief clip from Billy and Mandy where Grimm is watching Mexican soap opera, and he's like, I love you, Juanita! <laughs> so that's where I'm just drawing that from. Juan, could you come by the mansion and help me carry them? I'd really love to spend some time with you. If you want, maybe we can even go to the festival together. I should go. Hope to see you later, Juan. Bye, Faye. Hey, Juan, didn't you hear what she said? Now's your chance. Oh, ho, 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 this is better than watching my telenovelas. Whoa, how many times do I have to tell those kids not to play with fireworks? Coincidentally, I've just played another Metroidvania about fireworks. It was Animal Well. We banished the, uh, the final boss to the firework dimension. <laughs> What was I saying? Yes, El Presidente's daughter. You should, really should go see her. <laughs> and then the uh, Prince of Persia was, you know, about the Persian culture, obviously. Uh, there's also Tales of Kinzer Zao, that was African culture. So I like how cultural these Metroid Manias are. Hey, what on? What's up? Some chairs for the festival? Show out just. Hey, Dios mio! The president of his mansion is on fire! Do something, Juan! Uh, should that really be my responsibility? <laughs> La mansion del presidente. Hello there, undead spirit. Are you related to Sartana of the Dead? Oh, so someone is trying to play hero. You're far from the fields, I got it, boy. There's no place for you. Juan! What on? Run now before this ugly skeleton gets you too! Oh, you're holding her. Jeez. Oh my word! You're the freaking dude from Dead Cells! Ha ha! What do we have here? I sure wouldn't mind melting those eyes off your skull! Grand Salaka, it would be my pleasure to get rid of this intruder! Leave this to me, flame face. I could use a bit of action today. You look pretty cool. The lady on the right. Silencio! That's a Harry Potter spell. If... If Jaguar... If, if Hogwarts... Is it Jaguar or Hogwar? I don't remember. If Jaguar Xavier were here, he could be trusted to handle this. Unfortunately, he is occupied. I'll get rid of this beauty uh, humidor myself. I do want to say the J is pronounced as an H in Mexico. The living world may have chosen to forget me once, but I won't give them a choice this time. I'm Carlos Calaca, ruler of the dead world, and you, you're not even a lucha daughter. Prepare to die! <laughs> Spe special guess I couldn't read that in time. One! No! Hey guys, what I miss? Alright, there's another one we'll have to deal with in the future. <laughs> Alright, now the real plot begins, I assume. It's gonna take place in the land of the dead! And they're still we're still in the mansion, apparently. I've always liked the Dia de los Muertos aesthetic between these different cartoons I've seen. So I'm sure I'll enjoy whatever this game has to offer. And now it's offering me money. Calaca for mayor, okay. There's another obvious ground pound spot. Can I place map markers? Not as far as I can tell. I can't attack upward either. Oi! I'm the best. Hey, 
Oh, I'm just auto scrolling now. You look like an ability. And you look like Spider Woman. Greetings, one. I am Tosada, guardian of the mask. You know, Tales of Kinzer Zhao also used masks as power ups. How interesting that the mask has revealed itself to you. Kalaka has thrown the universe out of order. The whole universe, not just Mexico. You must have some role to play. If you put this mask on one, its power will bring you back to the world of the living. So we are in the lane of the dead. Are you ready? We gotta rip our clothes off. <laughs> We're real a luchador now. Nice tattoo. One screen kind of kills it a bit. Even la uh, okay, we get achievements. Luchador, over here! The town is under attack by evil skeletons! They flocked away! They locked everybody! You know what? If the barrel's talking, I'm gonna talk like the barrel from Conquer. They locked everybody! In the church, but I fear they intend to put it to the ground. Please save us! Before we go, the tutorials. I'll go save the town! I'll keep being a barrel. I'm not pretending. I really am a barrel. Okay, cool, yeah. Yeah, this is like the only co-op Metroidvania. Too bad I have no one to play with. Oh well. Alright, let's fight. Great start. I'll do semi solids. Nice. That was actually really cool. Alright, so, alright, let's just uh, see where I'm supposed to go. I guess I'll just have to go that way. Wait, I can go up here now, can I? Hey! Luchadore! You're not going to leave this people trapped in the church! I'll screw you! I mean, a big, tall, strong literal like yourself is it afraid of a few skeletons, are you? That's your chance. Save the day, and I'll keep scaring away birdies. Oh, I can have up to four players. That is cool. Okay, he just sporadically goes right when he goes down steps, and I don't know why. No! It's a dodge attack, but it's for the right analog stick, but my Joy-Con makes it react. Oh, that's gonna suck. God, I hate the Joy-Con so much. Oh, that's the wrong one. So you get more coins when you do combo points. Okay, sometimes... When I hold left with that, it goes right sometimes. I don't understand. Get back, you fiend! Help! Help! You there, Luchador! Save me from this Esqueleto! How are you not dead already if he's just attacking you right in the back? Thank you, my son. We weren't safe yet. We flocked all the townsfolk in the water closet. Help us! We're scared! And it smells gross in here! Ay ay ay! Here they come! <laughs> oh dear! Alright, you're teaching me how to dodge now, that's cool. Oh, okay, so when you do the shadow ones, you have to dodge them. That's interesting. They never really apply dodging as a combat, as a necessary combat thing like that. Can't thank you enough for what you've done here today, Digitor. Oh, we'd only get to see the people escape. 
Because they don't want to bother, like, redrawing this door. Alright, that's enough reading from me. I mean, I'm gonna speed read it from now on. <laughs> I really like how fast he moves, too. Now I don't have to keep repeatedly dodging to move faster, because the dodging is the exact same speed. Okay. Okay, I was supposed to keep staying this way. So I was supposed to keep going this way. Okay, now we can probably go that direction, okay. <laughs> you don't recognize me at all. Just walk away. Hmm. Bro, bro, you bro, bro. <laughs> All right, I have only have two not ninety paces. All right, well, definitely buying a health upgrade the first chance I get. Always the most important thing. Force del chivo. Oh jeez. Oh jeez! Stop right there, Lichino! Order is O'Connor's Kalaga! I want you to take one more step, and it would be your demise! Was that... you want to know who I am? Oh, you're a jaguar looking close, but no. Final days of Earth are upon us. I suggest you return home and spend them with the ones you love. So stop in this one. Lucidora, you say the church, an admirable and heroic feat. But your journey ends here. It pays me to unceremoniously dispatch warriors such as yourself. But you can't say I didn't want you. No! Gotta remember all these multicolored doors I can one day go through. Hot moment. Treasure! Alright, we can collect puzzle pieces. Is that like a health upgrade? Yeah, that kinda looks like it'll be a health upgrade, so then we should collect that. Something I can't interact with yet. <laughs> and these are checkpoints, I'm guessing. Or are you just shops? I don't know, are you checkpoints? I can't tell.
I haven't really encountered a save point yet, so maybe those are checkpoints. Well, there's definitely a secret over there. Ouch! Well, I couldn't press it in time, could I? Yeah, that's definitely a secret over there. Alright, nice platforming. Okay, that's cool. Like how they apply dodging that way. Okay, good, you can do it in midair. But I hate how just auto the Joy-Con just auto does it. That's gonna get so annoying. Feels like battle rim, obviously. Epic hit right there. got some kind of skull token. Oh, and we're very close to a potential health upgrade. Lots of platforming. Yay, I'm here now. Nice. That's actually pretty fun. We're gonna get the ability to interact with these red blocks. That sounds nice. Block door. Oh my god! Oh my god, they blatantly rip off the Chozo statue! God, that is... That is just ridiculous. What? You crazy luchador? Why you gotta go break my shoes of statue? <laughs> uh, th th at least this better be the only time in the game they do this, just to make the obvious reference. I can have a man, I've only got like 15 of those things left. Okay, there's gonna be more in the game. <laughs> there we go, luchador, I punch first and ask questions. Never! Oh, you're a shaman, dude. Behold, I am the great Uwe Chivo, lord of all man gods, warrior trainer extraordinaire, and king of awkward punishments! Now before you begin, tell me, is your mother single? Does she have a type? Does she like bad boys? Okay, okay then. Explain to me how you got here, and don't skip out on anything. Especially on how you got that mask. <laughs> Klaka, the temple of his daughter, daughter, and Jaguar Xavier, the former student. I just had to ask about to out after we saved the world. First, we must train you in the arts of a true legendora. The set you just broke contained a magical power. The rooster uppercut. Well, that, that explains why those red blocks are up arrows. Alright, red, red blocks can form in the air. Be careful, we use too much. Sorry, so bad. I don't know. Okay. You want. You work on that move, Kido. If it doesn't kill you, we'll, we'll, we'll continue your training next time we meet. Oh, da, 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 da. We got the rooster uppercut! See, now I have perfect justification to make that sound effect because it's just a Chozo ripoff. But we gotta come back here after we get the green ability. Well, that sucks. So, this is my double jump. That is cool. It's, it's a double jump attack.
All right. Uh, that, that just looks like the Hollow Knight mask, so maybe that's the health upgrade. I don't know. I mean, that's going to upgrade my stamina bar. Okay, so I see my health bar in the top left now has a, like, a yellow stamina bar beneath it. So that is, um... Yeah, yeah, I can see. So that's pretty cool. We need a blue blocks here. Oh, it actually tells you uh, the collectibles in the down right. I like it. I, I really like that. That'll help me keep track of everything. Um, I still can't buy a health upgrade. You suck. So over there, that's another block, but I don't think I'll have an easy time getting to that right now. Yes, okay, immediately going back for that thing. Yeah, I'll, I'll take a health chunk first. Oh, we need one more. So it's like a turn in Noctis. You need uh, three heart pieces to upgrade a heart container, instead of the typical four. I cannot go this way yet. Fine. But it's like that central falling room, where a bunch of blocks are. Okay, I see what I need to do here. That is cool. Alright, I cannot wait for whatever platforming trials this game will make us do. What? Alright, got a new enemy type. So you get those coins from beating kill rooms, but it doesn't really tell you how many there are on the map right now. Either way, I'm having a blast so far. This game's fun. get the ability to activate those ghost platforms. Reminds me of, uh, freaking Prince of Persia. We need to just have a peek this way. Alright, we can't go that way yet. We're gonna get that ability next, I wager. Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> this is a good place to practice throwing around. Oh, that was so cool. <laughs> that, this rim, achieve it flawless. Alright, that was so cool!
perfect place to get that achievement, I'm assuming. Because I, I don't think I even took damage there, so that was awesome. That's probably why I got the achievement. Santa Luchita! Oh! Skeletons just came running through town carrying some girl! They, they took her to the top of town and ran out towards the temple to the west! The dear Los Huertos! The student has been the dead have truly risen. I'm going to hide in the forest. It's safe there, right? Well, I cleared up most of the monsters, so yeah. Oh yeah, welcome to Santa Lucia. Looks like you can help yourself, Ninja Donna. The people at the, the town can really use your help. Don't be shy, you're a hero. It's what you do, right? Interesting. What is the point of this house? That's just freaking Booster from Mario RPG. I do like how these interiors actually get made on the map. It always irritates me when Metroidvanias don't do that. Alright, well that's just an easy one right there. Frick, I have enough money to buy a... A uh, stamina upgrade now, jeez. We're gonna get some kind of power that lets us go through small areas. Maybe we can shrink, that'd be neat. <laughs> okay. Can't go in there yet. <laughs> Oh, there's something up there. We're gonna get a wall jump power and we'll have to use it with our uppercut power. No. Vena del Polo! Alright, that sounds promising. <laughs> it sounded promising. That's that sucks. The world map is actually a little bit confusing. Doesn't feel properly interconnected like other Metroidvania world maps. At least um, at that kind of glance. That. No super hormonals. They just look like the Mario Bros. Ah, God, the references in this game are too much. Hmm. I can just get to that chest like this without well, easy. Okay, where did that rooster just go? No, I didn't want to come in here. Okay, so like, let me just have a quick peek. I assume I want to bring the angry roosters... to that cage up there? Maybe that window. God, idiot. I'm not trying to go up there, you idiot! Ugh, I give up! I give up! That is infuriating.
right? Got a side quest. It's awesome. <laughs> Well, you look unique. I'm desperate. My kitchen is bare. I don't have all the to make my specialty. Like when I had an enchilada. You ate my enchilada! Please, Leo, if you find some cheese, bring it to me. If you find the beans, bring them to me. The perfect chili. My tortillas! Alright, understood. Okay, I guess I need to bring the roosters to you. Okay, okay. So that's what you need to do next, actually. Alright, can I buy... I'm gonna save up for another freaking health thing so I can finally have my health upgraded. Okay, you're the combo chicken. <laughs> El Poncho! <laughs> Alright, this is just fighting tutorials, sounds fun. Yeah, this is kind of stuff I already got the gist of. I was, I was fighting the enemies. Okay. Uh. This is already reminding me of Prince of Persia's tutorials. I have to get the buttons just right. Alright. Oh, come on! Ah! Oh, come on! Achievement. Do or do not, there is no try. Thank you, Master... some kind of Yoda pun word. Alright. Cool. <laughs> sounds promising. Alright, that sounds interesting, I guess. Zioto Caliente. Well, the game wants me to keep going that way, so I'm just gonna go this way first, because why not? That's just freaking 8-bit Donkey Kong, but Mexican. Alright, so I can't go this way until I get the, the ground pound. Noted. Amazing Takia Bros. I don't know... I don't know if that's reference to anything. I... 
This kind of feels like I know this, but I also don't. Oh, so that's the bar. We can uh, destroy this from underneath somewhere, somehow. Are these children? What are they doing? Oh, they're like having... Oh, this, this is like a... I feel like this is a, a game, like a kind of cockfight thing I've seen. I don't really know what it entails. I can't really tell what those animals are down there. I see some, some children are having some small critters fight. Adorable. <laughs> Well, there's a health upgrade, finally. That was pretty simple. So we are going to get the ability to go through these small gaps. Maybe we'll just be the Morph Ball for just ripping off Metroid like that. Oh my god, I'm just five away! Jerk! Should I say, Ideos Mio, I'm just, uh, Cinco away. It's definitely gonna be a wall jump. Fast travel! I'm glad we're just getting the fast travel right now. Sounds awesome. I love it when fast travel feels simplistic. Temple of Rain. I couldn't tell. But I do love rain as an aesthetic. So this should be nice. Definitely gotta get the semi-solid platform ability here. Oh, you jerks. Yeah, I just want, like, five more money, please. AWESOME! Oh, is this how we're gonna do the semi-sold? Oh, yep, yep, that, that's it, that's it, that's it. So, yes, yeah, it's a, like a parallel worlds thing. It's not something you can toggle on and off, unless we get that ability later. That was just an easy uh, heart piece there. It really is a heart piece, come to think of it. I like it. Yes, this will give me the money. Save up for another one. And you can also uh, upgrade how much health you get. So that's cool. But right now, I'll just focus on buying health upgrades.
Oh, it's you. You're gonna be our first boss. Oh my, who do we have here? Is this the husky little door I've heard Jaguar Javier speak of? Hmm, seems like he's good down on the best parts. <laughs> ah, little door, loosen up. I suppose you're looking for a Kalaga. He's off with flame face and that girl, preparing for a ceremony. Maybe instead of chasing after them, you and I could have a bit of fun. BAM! Okay. Hmm, no effect. Well, if we meet again, maybe you'll be worth my attention. Right now, Kalika's pet, Alegrije, calls to me. Alegrije. He is learning, in the need of some... Seriously! Heavy! Petting! <laughs> Double and tangeries. Aloysius, we have a guest. Please make him comfortable. Alright, new enemies. They loosely look like the flea from Mucha Lucha. Alright, this is actually a fun combo battle. Oh man, there's a lot of you! Jeez, okay, I'm just now learning what you do, actually. head back this way. What secrets will we find? Uh-huh. Okay. Nothing particularly crazy there. And then we just changed back, so I'm not really sure the point of that was. fun. Oh, that's cool! Oh, okay, so it's actually, um, I thought, I thought I already had the upgrade, but I was actually missing the, the jaw. <laughs> well, the clever little deception there, clever. Alright, so now we officially have a stamina upgrade. And I'm guessing we're gonna get that, uh, yellow ability next. I assume that's gonna be a charge attack, because every Metroidvania needs a charge attack. Don't really have anything, anything... Well, that's terrifying. <laughs> okay, thanks for not chasing me right yet. Oh, that's cool! So that's what the shadows actually mean. It's just a parallel world. Easy enough, perfect. Oh, you're a new one. should I be in right now? That's the question. Ow. Ouch! I'm an idiot. Alright, this isn't gonna be a wise decision. But here we go. Okay. 
Okay, I can just jump up here. Okay. Oh, okay! Alright! Good old Metroid reference. <laughs> the goat jump. Is this the wall jump? Yep, it's the wall jump. <laughs> Love it. Da -da 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 -da, we got the goat jump! <laughs> Alright. Just how I love it. <laughs> but we can't uh, keep hugging the same wall. Like in Hollow Knight and other Metroid Manias. I assume that creature just woke up, so that's not gonna be bueno. Hi. <laughs> yep, yep, it definitely woke up. We can go this way. Could we go this way? Leap of faith! <laughs> no, okay, thank you for not killing me, though. <laughs> yeah, I kind of figured that much. Oh boy. Yep, this is definitely uh, a Prince of Persia puzzle now. I love it. That just loops us back around here. Okay, is there any reason to actually come through this cave again? Not quite. Oh dear. Oh dear. Alright, having to deal with these guys in the parallel world is not gonna be fun. Or wait, or, or if they're in the shadow world, could they not damage me? Because the first time we did this, it was just the, for the the dodging tutorial. And then a stamina piece. Delightful. Alright. Love uh, dead ends. Gotta close all those corners of the maze. I'm still gonna wait for the health upgrade. So I think if I get that he uh, heart piece, I can get another you know, bar of health. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh! Okay, so there, you're not going to be in parallel worlds. We're just going to drop you down to your doom. That This is creative! Oh, this is so creative. <laughs> I'm already at 21% completion. That's awesome. Or so that's just for this area. God, will you quit doing that, Joy-Con?
All right, that was the real one. That was the real one, and it gave me a heart container. Good game. Man, this is such a good game. Where the heck am I? Well, I didn't mean to do that, but it doesn't matter. So I still can't interact with the shadow ones. Oh my word! No, I should actually be using the, uh, idiot. My, um, aerial combos. Alright, that was pretty easy. Oh, and we're immediately getting the yellow power! Oh, man! Two abilities in one dungeon! Awesome! Gonna just be the charge attack, right? Seriously, don't break my stuff. Seriously. The Olmec's headbutt. Press A while standing still to send those as great as sky high. Da -da 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 -da. We got Olmec's headbutt. I'm get going before I find your mother. You're a creep. Okay. Platforming. And now we've cleanly looped back around this room. Delightful. Still plenty of this dungeon to go. Okay, okay, we gotta get back down to that yellow door, so we just gotta head this way. Easy, easy, cheesy, as they say. Where am I going? No, I just had to go back down here. Perfect. Ugh, idiot. Just a test. Yeah, I figured it was going to be something optional. Wow, you gave me five of those kill room skulls. Well, that's awfully generous of you. Um, okay, any more yellow things? Nah. So far this area just seems pretty secluded, and I appreciate that. Well, more of it next time. I am loving this game.